Hello again, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to compare the RTX 4080 to the RTX 3080 and see which is the best deal and the best bang for your buck. I think you're gonna to start to notice a pattern here. All right, so let's again start with our little benchmark comparison. If you look at the 4080 compared to the 3080, you'll notice that it's fairly significant, a lot faster, as much as 60 something percent now let's get into pricing. So there's, it's significantly better. All right, so again, if we're looking for a RTX 4080, they're still relatively new. You can find a few used ones on the market if we look at uh, Newegg. And you'll see that new there, 11 to 1200, again, depending upon the variant that you want. Looking on eBay, they have come down, it appears, but here's the thing about shopping on eBay for these higher dollar graphics cards. Let's just choose one at random. If we click on this one, you notice that it is not a real auction. So if we click on the 950, this one has a seller that has feedback of zero. In no way, shape, or form should you ever purchase anything from a seller that has zero feedback, you will get ripped off or have a problem where a month down the line, you never receive the card and you have to get a refund. So please do not buy anything like that. Coming on down a little bit, we can see that at 990, this does appear to be a real seller, but we're saving 180 or so dollars off new and maybe that's worth it maybe it's not so the 3080 comes in new at 650 ish depending again upon the variety that you want but this is where the significant money savings come in if we check ebay now we can see that you can get them for as little as in the 400 dollar range and again these are decent sellers and there'll be multiple varieties you can choose from but are you going to choose a $900 graphics card that is 50% better? Or are you going to choose one that can be had for as cheap as $400 and save between $500 and $600? I can't make up your mind, but to me, the 3080 is a much better deal because it has depreciated somewhat. But... In all of these situations, we have to check on our wild card. And in this case, our wild card is the 3080 Ti. So if we compare, the 4080 is still significantly better than the 3080 Ti. And if, as we see here, you're really not gaining a lot between the 3080 Ti and the 3080. So as we always do, let's end with checking prices here. And the 3080 Ti comes in around 500. Is this an actual seller? It is. So the 3080 Ti comes in around $525 or so. So if you recap, do you want the $1,200 graphics card? The $500 graphics card that's about 35% less or the... $375, $400 graphics card that's about 50% less. I can't advise you on what to do, but if I were you, I would be looking for an RTX 3080 if you didn't have to have really high-end graphic settings. Thank you again for watching.